On the fourth day of Christmas, Dana gave to us. Welcome back, campers. We're on day four of the 12 days of Beast Mode Christmas camping. That's right. Woo! Woo! On day one, we got the holiday flames. The holiday flames. I'm going to go ahead and chuck one in. Yeah, put it right there in the, in the hot Boom. spot. Oh, yeah. Boom. Day two, we got the hot toddies. We're drinking hot toddies. We got the uh, Alabama Slammer. What is this? It's the Alabama... Um, Alabama... Apple oh, cider. Apple cider. Well, whiskey apple cider. Whiskey cider. Alabama whiskey, whiskey apple cider. Oh, look at the green and the blue. Here we go. Woo. We got the flames kicking. Nice. And then on day three, we got the fireside chats. Now, these chats <laughs> uh, help to create conversation amongst friends. So, right. And <clears throat> today's day four, we get to open a new one. But you want to you check out one of them cards first? Yeah. Before we get going. Because we got our, our colorful fire, we got our hot toddies. So let's let's have a uh, let's have a card. I'll just grab this one right here. Alright. And I'm gonna grab I got the three of hearts. This one right here. This is cool too because this deck is actually a deck of cards too, so you can play cards with it. I got the three of hearts. Yep. But yeah, it has all of these, a question. all of these gifts previously we're gonna leave the link in the description so yeah, you can check yeah. them out. Yeah, we'll do that. Alright, what's your question say? Okay, Tony, if you had to give up one of your five senses, which would you choose? I, I, shoot, I wish to God I'd have gotten this question. Because you know what it would have been last night. Your ears? <laughs> my nose, my sense of smell. <laughs> hey, why don't you tell them what happened last night? I don't know. Somebody thought it'd be funny to soak a, a, a wash rag with some, uh, what is it? Ass juice. Ass juice. Okay, so uh, spray or something. Uh, okay, so Dana, my fiance, is a giant prankster. <laughs> I'm not a huge prankster, <laughs> so I went ahead and did it, and it's this ass spray <laughs> that uh, smells like the worst smell you've ever. Smelled. Oh, it's worse than ass. It is. Oh. It was literally and, and of course me, I have no idea. So I, um, I'm going to lay down to go to sleep and, and I've got this uh, nasal congestion. congestion going on and I'm looking for something to blow my nose. And by the way, there's this rag sitting right there and I'm like- Cause I just sprayed it on a rag. And where did this rag this come from? I don't know, but there's nothing else. So I grabbed this rag and commenced to blow and snot into it. And then I'm like, what in the <laughs> hell? <laughs> And I put my face all in it, and now I'm smelling and, this and stuff. And, I've oh. got to say, it is the worst smell Man. I've ever smelled. It, it, was, it was horrible. Gosh. Okay. Well, maybe we can get a, find a link to that oh, but and that throw was, it in there, that too. Was, that was a question for me. I know, but that's. I was just saying okay. I know what my sense would be to give up. I'd give right. up my sense of smell. So let me ask you, so Jeez. if I could give up a sense, uh, definitely not eyes or ears. I love music. I love being able to see stuff. Maybe I'd give up taste. I, I, I think I'd give up taste before anything else. And you know, that'd make it easier to go on a diet. Because then you wouldn't care about food so much. You could just literally eat. Whatever. Yeah. Of course, then this hot toddy wouldn't taste so damn good either. Though. I think I would go without taste. You're right. And actually, during COVID, I lost uh, smell and taste. Right, right. And so I think I would go with taste. Taste. All right, All right. cool, cool. Here's your question. <laughs> Describe the biggest blessing in disguise you've ever experienced in your life. I'd, I'd have to say probably uh, blessing in disguise because I, I I know this one I just can't remember what it was. I want to say it was losing a job. And you found a better one. Right, and found a better one. Awesome. Or actually, that may have been um, it may have been how I had got into starting my business was uh, was losing a job and and being forced to just go freelance and and it. it turned out to be the best thing that ever happened to me, you know? Or one of the best things. So yeah, that would have to be it. Cool. The loss of a job. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, uh, by the way, these hot toddies, Alabama Slammers, mm, are- uh, Alabama Whiskey Cider. Ridiculous. Yeah, they're very good. I All think right. it's tasting even better tonight. I think since we already did it once, cooked it up once, second time around, we cooked it up a little better, I think. Uh oh, is this number four? This is- Present number four. No, no. You wanna Numero cuatro. see if you can guess what it is? Numero cuatro. 
Ah. You Go ahead. Open it. Or you open, it. open it. Open it. You right. open it. While you do that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw. Look at that. And as a reminder, this is uh, Dana put this all together for us. Yes, with the specific instructions to only open one each night and not to peek. I'm gonna throw this right there. Yeah. So again, big thanks to Dana for putting this all together. Yes, yeah, awesome. This is awesome. All right, what do we got? What do we got? <clears throat> oh God, what is it? I can't see through the box. What do you got? All right, we got a pair of walkie talkies. Oh, this is awesome. Oh boy, old school, dude. All right, so uh, <laughs> what's Check funny? It out. So we'll be able to talk to each other from our different. Yeah, tents, you're saying, but... Tony, <laughs> come get your smelly rags out of my freaking tent. <laughs> You know what's funny about this? What? There's definitely a grown-up factor for these. Yeah. Used for these, but there's also a little kid factor of, hey buddy, what are you what doing? Are you doing and, uh, I showed our uh, <coughs> popcorn video <laughs> to a bunch of people. By the way, I'll post the link to the popcorn <coughs> video right here, where everyone said, first Dana said, you guys need supervision out there. And, supervision, <laughs> and parental other, supervision. Yeah, and other people said, uh, are there any adults out there with you guys? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, not one. All right, this is awesome. Looks like uh, we'll need to get some batteries for them. I have plenty of batteries out here. Oh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> there it goes. We have liftoff. What's up there, Tony? Can you hear me? I can hear you loud and clear. Come back. <laughs> This is gonna be too much fun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go for a night walk tonight just so I can tell you what's going on on the walkie. What's that? I hit monitor. Oh, that just rings me. Hey, good buddy, are you there? Oh yeah. I can hear you loud and clear. Hello. Uh, All right. It's working. <laughs> too much fun. Yeah. All right, we're gonna have a blast at these. All right, this is cool. Merry Christmas, Tony. Merry Christmas, Steve. <laughs> So that this is day four of Christmas. Come back twelve for day days five. of Christmas. Yeah. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Yeah, leave us a comment. But we are making a series out of these, so hopefully you guys will be able to enjoy all of them. Right. Thanks. Merry Christmas, everybody. Next time, Merry Christmas. <laughs>